Paweł here. So now I um, will try to show you how the Mag Animator version 5 works. Uh, thank you very much for awesome uh, response. It's great. Thank you very much, Prex, for doing um, a video about Mac versions. But I know there is still plenty, plenty of people who use the Windows. So I'll try to uh, explain how to download and how to install it. It's very, very simple. It's few basic steps. But I understand it might be con confusing for um, uh, for some of you. So. Um, um, at the beginning, I would like to apologize. I don't have a Windows machine. This is the this is a Mac, but I'm running a Windows on it. It's not the 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 prettiest kit on the blocks, but it works. So if you see the Mac animator or something else looks a little bit odd, don't worry. It's only because I'm using a virtual machine. So um, let's start. So at the beginning, obviously, you need to go to the website to download it. So here it is. Just go for the www.maganimator.com uh, and this website will show. It's very fast website, so um, it's very basic. It's just pointing out all the features um, of the Mag Animator. Um, some some um, some screenshots here. You no, know, quite quite nice screenshots. So you can you can uh, check check them out. Um, let me. Oh, there, oh, sorry. Oh, there is there is a frame. You you can see a frame on on the on the screen, the table which shows a Mag Animator free version, and Mag Animator registered version. What this means for you? This means for you that Mag Animator is free. You can use it as long as you want, but it's a little bit limited, as you can see here. Um, you can on for the hobbyist is great. You can use 15 mockups a day. You shouldn't need any more. Um, you will see advertising on the on the app because this is this is how I um how I make my uh, beer money, you know. This this time you need to return somehow. So um, so I'm not I'm not trying to bombard you with the with all the crappy shitty um um unrelated um ads. So all of the ads, mo most of them anyway, ninety nine point nine percent are industry related so please check them out they all about sublimation about printing so you can only benefit so please help me out and check them out so okay and now there is a mag animator registered so otherwise is a, in other words is mag animator pro version pro version is has no limits has no mock-up limit so if you're in business and you're making loads and loads and loads of them that's fine go for the pro and you can make them a whole day long um, the, uh, also adds a disappearing so you have a nice and cleaner look um, and another feature is that you you gain in mp4 video uh, processing um, in the pro version which is much higher quality much faster recording and much smaller um, in the megabytes so it's much smaller size in the, in in the megabytes so you upload faster to your website upload faster to your emails upload faster to the facebook everything is basically faster so this is at the moment is nine dollars 99 cents so this is only for next 48 hours as prex mentioned in his previous video thank you very much again uh, i i appreciate that okay so this is this is basically basic. You whenever you have a spare couple of minutes, you can you can pop it on the website and have a read if you fancy it. So what's in, what's interesting you now when you end up on this website, you can see Mac Animator logo and under Mac Animator logo, you can see download free for Mac and download free for Windows. Obviously, Prex did for the Mac, so we're not interested with this this button. We're interested with the bottom button. Download free for Windows. Now, some people still using all the Windows and they are 32 bits um, Mac Animator is e, is a 3D software so he is quite um, not sure how to say it um, he has a quite high expectation it, it, it needs some juice it needs some uh, memory and needs some um, and it, it needs some uh, CPU power to generate all those great 3D items for you so I did make 32 bits. If it works for you, brilliant. I'm happy with you. But most of you, you should use 64 bits. Okay, when you click on the download free for web windows, let's see if something show up. 
maybe. Oh, sorry, actually, yeah, let's let's do it a different way. Let's do it on everything in the window. So we um, so we move to the virtual machine now. <coughs> there we go. I disappeared. My ugly mug. And so it depends which browser you use. Obviously, Windows come with the Edge, which is, um, in my opinion, the, 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 the really, you know, not greatest uh, browser um, on the planet. But it's a browser, so probably most of you use use it. Or Chrome, or Safari, or Firewall. Um, uh, what's the other one called? Well, I can't remember. Opera or something. Never mind. Everyone works pretty much the same way. So that's where we start. www.mag. Anita.com, and here we are. So, download free for Windows. That's when we're going to click, and now you can see the bar on, at the bottom. What do you want to do with Mag Animator? Right, what do you want to do? You want to download it, so you do not click open because you probably won't know when it downloads. Don't you can click save, but I would suggest click, click the little arrow and go for save as. This let you decide what you want to what you want to um, uh, download it. So let's go to the desktop. Everyone can find desktop and just save. It takes probably a couple of minutes because it's 152 megs. As there is two mag animators in this file, there is two. Why there's a two? There is a 32 bits and 64 bits. I just join them all together to make it more simple for for everyone. If you use 64. It's fine. Get rid of the 32. Just chuck it in the in the in the bin. If you use 32, do exactly the same thing with 64. Okay. So um, it's 50 percent uh, gone now. So 50 seconds. While we while we download it, I would like to say a massive thank you for to my old buddy uh, Prex again. Thank you very much for your help. I'm, I'm, you know, massively, massively appreciate your help, with, and um, thank you for testing the very first uh, Mag Animator version 5. You know, you are first person on the planet, except me and my uh, my friend who are coders, um, who help me with the project, obviously, but uh, your first person outside uh, who actually had it, and it was registered as well, so well done. Uh, okay, 82%, soon be done. Obviously, that might be much much quicker. If in, in probably in US you have a much faster uh, broadband than me in the UK, especially when it's Saturday evening. Now most people actually sit in and play Xbox Live and all that. So they, so there is a massive massive uh, overuse. Anyway, okay, here we go. Everything is done as you can see. You can use the button View Downloads or Open the Folder. If you go Open the Folder, it should show up exactly where it is. Ta -da, can you see? There is there is the there is the window. But we know we send it on the desktop. So let's go to the desktop. Here we go. This is this is the mag animator. And now there's a first step when people are doing it wrong. They see the folder, they click on it, they go to mag animator and they think they can run it. Here we go. This is the 64 and 32 bits. I'm, I know my Windows is 64. Mo by the way, if you if you run in Windows 8 or Windows 10, you you 100% uh, 64. So always go for the 64. So what, what, that's where the people goes wrong. Click on it and go for the mag animator, and there's nothing happening. They run, it's nothing happening because this file, those files are still packed, still compressed. So you need to uncompress them first. Okay, so we're going back again, and we uncompress the file. So you click on that zipped file, zipped file, as you can see the zip in it. Right mouse button, and go for extract all. Now we're unpacking the, all the files. <coughs> Excuse me. Stay a while. As I said, there's the two packages in it. <coughs> Go 
but this is the correct way of doing it. Never ever go inside the zip file and just try to run it. What you do when you try and run the one file, but the rest of it untouched, they not extract, so they, they won't work. Mag Animator need all the files in the folder to work properly. It should be finished. As you can see, there's many, many files in here. They all important files, so Mag Animator run smoothly. By the way, guys, if there is anything you would like to see in the Mag Animator, I'm open to offers. I'm open to any suggestions, as long as those those items are quite generic, so everyone can benefit. More people can benefit. That's great. I'm happy to do it. But if there is any any custom made item by you, obviously that w wouldn't be economical to to um, to make three D shape and three D item just for one or two people on the on the planet. So so please accept my apologies. You know, but I I would love to try to help you. I would love to, I love to help you, but please ask for more generic items like mugs. Everyone use mugs, plates, slates. I'm I'm happy to add different different uh, shape of slates, but that's that, that's gonna gonna come within the time. Okay. And so is unpacked now. So is the file zip file. You can you can put it on your Google Drive. You can put it in in your record on a disk. You can go on a Dropbox, whatever you want to do with it, or you can just uh, chuck it away. And this is the important folder we want. So we go in in it. Go to Mag Animator inside, and now you can see two different things. I know I'm running 64 bits. So I'm going to 64 bit and this is where the Mag Animator is. Mag Animator Windows 64 bit 5.0. This is when you click twice. And that's what you might see if you if you run in a Windows um, 10 and your protection is not off. There is nothing wrong with a Mag Animator, but this file it was done by me and not Microsoft. And Microsoft never checked my files, because why should they? Uh, and they think it could be potentially dangerous file. You can trust me. It's not dangerous. I checked it. It's safe. I wouldn't. I wouldn't risk you with any dodgy files. So if you if you run into this problem, what you need to do just click more info and run anyway. Or you can just whitelist in in the in the windows. But that's easy way to do it. And here we go. Just wait for the mag animator to show up. Is 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 going a little bit slow as I said because it's a virtual machine. So my apologies for that. It's, it, not here it is. It's behind. Actually behind. So it probably wasn't that slow. So let's get rid of this window. So here is the window. If you want a full in the full window, that's cool. Just click it. Click the window. Tick off. Pick the resolution you like. And go for it. I like my Mag Animator windowed, so I can see I can see what's around it. But obviously that's personal, so you you do whatever you want, and click play. Here it is. This is the splash screen of Mag Animator, which is unregistered. This is a free version for everyone, so please feel free to download it. You don't need to pay for anything to download it to check it out. It's a completely free trial. It. Uh, test it, test drive it, smash it to the bits, you know, do whatever you want with it and let me know if you like it. If you like it, please go for the pro version and help me out. Okay, so this is the splash screen, obviously it's a free, so he's asking for donation, you don't need to do that if you don't want to, just skip. And here he is, here is the main window. As you can see the mug doesn't look too pretty because the the uh, graphic card on uh, on this laptop and Windows virtual machine is not great, but it does the job. Anyway, so so basically something a little bit about the window. So that's basically it. It's very simple. There is only a few buttons here. Um, uh, this is the, this is the working canvas. This uh, um, rectangle. Uh, this is when your images are showing up. So here's the button for the images. We just click on it. And pick the image you like. So let's say go for the nice full image. <coughs> Excuse me. OK. 
Okay, and here is. You can stop the mug with your mouse. You. This is called. This is called free hand. You can. You can um, direct your mug in the position you want. Okay, let's say that way. You can see handle, and you can still see the graphics. So it's lovely. Well, look what happened now. Look what will happen now. There is a little arrow in the in the bottom right corner, which you can stretch your artwork right in whole printable area and almost instantly showing on the mag so here we go this is your mag now you can make it keep spinning if you click play here you go so that's lovely that's already lovely looking mag but it's a little bit empty so let's put a background on uh, behind you can see there is a bottom of background many people say oh my bottom is gray out i can't do anything sorry guys i, I gotta change it in the next version i promise this is not a bottom this is just say background options so when you set bat uh, background is actually click set here it is and now you can go for the background here we go that's a nice background and this is it it is already lovely looking a mock-up when i tell you something when you send this mock-up to the customer, I'm telling you that now, they're gonna buy it. They're gonna buy your mug. Do you know why? It's because it's not something they imagine. It's something they actually can physically see how their mug will look. So if people see, it's it's like a test drive in a car. If if you're looking if you're looking for a car on the street, you like the car. Oh, it's lovely. It's lovely. It's brilliant. Yeah, I like that car. But when you go to the showroom and you put your ass in that car for the test drive. Can I t can tell you something? Probably fifty or sixty sixty uh, percent uh, more possibility you actually will buy it because you put your bum in the car. So it's exactly the same thing with with this program. When you when you send those mockups to your customer to show him how we mug lo will look like, he will go for it because he thinks he already own it because he can see it. So yeah, he's. Try it. Try it, guys. Let me know if it works for you. I know there are some success stories. There's people buying the program from me, and within the 48 hours, they sold five marks only because of the um, because of the they did some mockups and people like it, which is great. This is what keeps me going. If you've been selling the obviously not only mugs, uh, if you've been selling all the all the all the mm -hmm. items, and that program will help you, I will be chuffed to bits. Here we go. This is. I'm not sure, obviously, how many of those items are available in US, but they they all in here in UK. So that's the metal metal mag, camping mag. That's the coaster. Obviously, if you're selling a mag, send them. Look, look, look. Watch this. Do you remember the the, the mag I just did with the fall image? Great. People want it. Yeah. Let's say people people send you the image. And you send them the mock-up. What you're doing next with the mock-up, what you need to do, you need to get through to the coaster, put exactly the same image to the coaster. Where is the image? Come on. Oh, here we go. This is the coaster. This is the coaster for the for the make a spin, record it to the animated GIF, and send them to. Send them and say for extra two dollars or whatever, three dollars. I don't know what's the rate for them. Now you can have a matching coaster, and they will go for the coaster. They will go for it because it's a set. It's obviously more beautiful. So yeah, this is this is the this is just a marketing move you need to do. Um, what else we have here? Um, obviously, um, extremely popular item, which is a slate. I think it's a one of my favorite items and most. I think I sold most. Yeah, I'm, I'm as sold as many slates as as other items. Obviously, not as many as mags, but but slates. Yeah, slates is the item when I when I get most profit. I can get uh, about twenty twenty five pounds profit on each, or uh, probably thirty dollars in your own money. Um, okay, I think I'm talking too much now, so I'll go to the business. Okay, so you got um, vertical, horizontal, slate, um, love, mark, cozy, but you you probably have seen it all on the Prex videos. I would like to show you one thing that, that with the sublimation, um, sublimation t-shirts, you got brilliant t-shirts, lovely white t-shirts, but if you do vinyl or if you do transfers on the color shirts, yeah, change the color, why not? Here we go. This is, this is when you can change the color. So black t-shirts, no problem. 
and put put the put the um what do you call um transfers on it that's not a problem look that's not a problem at all bang here we go obviously that this this is a free or bigger than a free but obviously if you have only a four yeah you, you just you just go and make it smaller make it smaller that's not a problem bang obviously position that properly and people will love it i sold loads of t-shirts because of that because people have seen how they look okay there is a polo shirts or golf shirts i don't know what you call them in in your in your country here we go same thing you can change the colors of them or you can keep them white as a sublimation great feature about this item is you can put the left or right um breast logo you know about us but in in uk most of the time is the is the left breast logo so if we go for the left breast logo here we go same as background here we go now you can see two here we got r for right and l for left and you can pick whichever you want here is so let's say that will be left side logo graphic on the back that's no problem because we got that covered and abracadabra make it spin and send it to the customer and I tell you something customer already love it because you can see it here we go okay let's do a bit more here we go that's the pillows this is US um, rich numbers and here we go <laughs> many people ask you what's that item that's a mouse pad guys that's the mouse pad. That's an old good mouse mat. So I'm not sure how is how is it selling in US, but in UK it's still selling right. You know, you can also use it as a as a placemat. I say, I, I, I suppose, but you know, but that in generally general idea was to make it as a mouse mat. Oh, the shopping bags very extre extremely popular now because we we moving away from the plastics. I carry bags everyone use those canvas bags now latte uh, f this is this is the plate for 3d for 3d machines so it's full wrap and obviously some great looking uh, water flask and all that so I will be adding more and more and more stuff there will be ladies t-shirts coming in there will be loads of other stuff coming in so here it is okay guys let's come back to what we're interested the most probably most of us is the mugs okay with the mags okay mag is here hold on a second okay mag is here let's where's the graphics where's my graphics so oh, oh, this will be here let's go for a picture of beautiful autumn And what is this software about now this software is about to show in the mock-up <clears throat> excuse me if you have an online shop if you're selling on eBay and you have a 20 30 graphics do you really want to print 30 marks photograph them uh, to show them on eBay what you can do uh, I don't think so so it's better off so so it's better off just place your graphic by the way, if you like to clear a background for, for the website, that's no problem. You can take it off with the clear button. And you can take a screenshot. Here we go. Let's show you mug. Let's say just a mug. And we're going to save it on the desktop. And look. back that was a second that was literally a second here we go and this is how it looks like ready for your youtube for, sorry not for youtube ready for your ebay store etsy um your online store whatever you do if you go two-sided um bag just spinning around and do exactly the same thing screenshot it okay so let's do another one mug two bang a few seconds job done wait a couple seconds this is your max so now you have a 
two mags ready for you on Linstar. Okay, but that can be done in many softwares. What's the great about this software is that you can make it virtual. So here we go, this is MP4, which works only three times as a trial in this free version, but then it GIF, animated GIF works at least 15 in a day. So great for hobbyists. So you can obviously choose the quality, low, medium, high. I'll go for low, only because this is virtual machine, go less, less power much 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 less power so we don't want to take it for too long okay we're gonna save it like that as you can see it's not it's not great it's not going that slow but obviously it's not the fastest so let it run and see what we come up with well you can see already file start processing here I don't know if you see, guys, it's uh, 17 minutes to 9. So it's dark outside. I don't know about, I think in the US it's probably midday now or something. Or you're eating your lunch. Um, okay, so there we go. It's done, so it wasn't that slow. Let's see what we got. Let's open it. Here we go, it's spinning. As you can see, the hard edges. The hard edges is because it's a virtual machine. As I said, it's not going to be the prettiest kid on the block, but it still works. It still works. So you got, so you got the idea. Here we go. But if you use the MP4 feature in the in the uh, registered version, the mug look, look much much nicer because the GIF is very limited to the colors. MP4 is not. So, so. Basically, we've got all the we covered all the buttons now, so you know what's where. Um, if for those people who would like to register the version, you can click just buy pro, and it takes you to the website of Mag Animator. Or if you already did, if you already purchased the, the code, oh, which I have here, which I have here, you you just click that yellow key. You put your email there, your key here, and click register, and off you go. All those adverts will disappear, but you have to restart your software. You will have to restart it at least twice um, to, to make it all work great. So um, I hope that explained everything. Guys, if, if you have any question, you know you know where I am. You know, I'm always on the group, always on the forum, so you just drop me an email, drop me a PM, no problem. I, I try to answer on for every single one. I never leave the um, message without the answer. Even if I don't know the answer, I say, I'm sorry, I can't help, but I will reply. So, um, but if you see me not, not replying too fast, that means I'm in bed. <laughs> so, you just uh, be patient, just wait. Oh, what's happened? Just wait, and... Um, and I would definitely, definitely come back to you. Or if I'm not coming back to you within the 48 hours, you just give me a good kick in the Facebook again, and I will come back. Because maybe, maybe, sorry for this very bold video. It was quite long. It was much longer than I expected, but I'm a bit of a chatterbox. <laughs> so, um, as I said, if you like it, please purchase it. It's only a tenner. It's only a tenner. It will be $19.99 soon. It's still worth the money, but you can have it for a tenner, for under $10. So thank you very much. And um, see you uh, printing soon.